I feel pretty comfortable saying that I understand Alex Dime. Ever since, at the age of one, uh, I met a new friend at a Glen Ridge playgroup with, curiously, an almost identical name. It is almost as if the universe arranged matters such that our nearly matching names were a signpost for what would truly be a powerhouse of a friendship. And going to college, I was of course apprehensive about whether or not I would be able to find new friendships, and for a new city and a new chapter, I had a new best friend in Emily. And in less than a year, albeit one, I already felt that I knew Emily as well as any of my friends from home. So almost inevitably, when my best friend from childhood and my best friend from college began to interact, I thought, we might have something here. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. I love your dress. <laughs> your dress is amazing. You excited? I am. <laughs> I think I've loosened up, finally. Alex, in the days leading up to today, I've been reflecting on the time when I first knew that I loved you. A feeling of love for you that almost seven years later, I feel as intensely as I did on that day. You are truly an amazing person. You have taken me to places I otherwise would never have gone and pushed me to do what I otherwise would never have done. I will always have one eyebrow raised at the world with you. And I promise to keep laughter a part of every day. Here's to the past and all that we have learned. Here's to the present, for which we are grateful to be sharing with you. And here's to the future, which we will navigate together as husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, with great pride, I give you Emily and Alex, the bride and groom. Here, here. Cheers.